Okay, I just wanted to make you a quick video on how to, what I've discovered uh, back when I first did this. So basically, here we are. I created an assignment in Duck Soup. Um, I think you've probably already done that part. So now, if I'm a student, this is my student view. So as a student, I click on the assignment. It's the assignment the teacher created. When I click on it, it takes me directly to Duck Soup to that assignment. I go in, I put in my info. This is just something silly I created. And um, when I'm done, I click Grade E Sheet. And when I click Grade E Sheet, that takes care of everything as far as, you know, it's telling me it's not complete, but I'll just grade it anyway. It takes care of everything. As far as the student's concerned, it automatically creates it so the teacher can actually collect the grades. But if I want to signal my teacher that I'm done with that E Sheet, what I do is I click on that button, I choose the class inside my Google Classroom, I choose the assignment, that was the name of the assignment, click go, I click attach, now it's going to attach this, this is a different link, this is actually a link to the hand grade section of my specific e-sheet as a student, <clears throat> so I click attach. And then right there, it turns into View Assessment. I click View Assessment. It takes me to my Google Classroom, and then I click Turn In. So now my, my work is turned in. So now as a teacher, <clears throat> it says one has turned it in. I click on it. I can see that this student has turned it in. I can click here, and it will actually take me now this is a teacher, it takes me to their, their hand graded e-sheet. So this right here is the actual hand graded e-sheet. And I can actually see, so this right here is the student's view, what the student actually, uh, I'm as a teacher, I'm looking at what the student did. Up here you can tell that I can now go through each student, I can switch through classes, I can change their grade, I can you know go through and hand grade it if I wanted to. Or I can just look at it and see what they answered, or, you know, I can write and feedback on uh, what they did on the written part. So, anyway, I hope that answers your question. Uh, please feel free to email me if you have any more questions.